Hello everybody, this is Joe Leonard with GeoVision. This video will serve as an overview of the GeoVision Edge Recording Manager Mac version. Edge Recording Manager is a free program that allows users to remotely view up to 32 channels of live video and one channel of playback video. The Mac version can be downloaded from the Apple App Store. This video will serve as an overview of the setup and basic use of the GeoVision Edge Recording Manager Mac version. When you first open the Mac version of the Edge Recording Manager software, you will have a blank matrix here. The first thing you will want to do is add in a host. To do that, you will click on the setup icon in the top right, and then you will click on the controller icon on the left. This will bring up your camera list. We will now want to add the host by clicking the plus sign. And you have two options for adding in a host. If you are local, where the NVR is at on the same local network, you can actually scan and find your local cameras. For this video, we will add in an external host. So you'll want to click on the plus sign, and then you will want to enter the information about your host. You will need your external IP address, as well as your port information, and you will need to do port forwarding on your router that's on site. Once you enter the information about your host, you will want to expand the advanced setting section, and then you will want to click on the refresh button. This is going to query your NVR and find all of your cameras from the NVR. You will then want to put a check mark next to all of the cameras that you want to bring in for live and playback footage. Once you check your cameras, you will click on the next icon and then click apply. This will add the cameras to your host list, and now you have the ability to bring cameras in for live view. To do that, you can simply click on the camera and drag and drop it into the window that you want to display the camera in. Once you have your cameras added, you can click on the eye icon to go to the live view, and then you can click on the controller icon to make it full screen the cameras. If you'd like to full screen a camera, you can simply double click on it, and it will bring up the camera full screen. If you'd like to zoom, you can go up into the left-hand corner where the camera name is listed, and you can click on it and click PIP, and then you can use two fingers on your Mac mouse to be able to scroll up and zoom in your camera. You can zoom in, zoom out, and then you have the ability to click to drag and look around your scene as well. You can simply double click to go back to your matrix and view your other cameras. If you'd like to save a favorite group of cameras, there is the icon up in the top right, which is a star icon. This is the favorites icon. If you click on it, you can hit add my favorite. And for example, if you'd like to group all of your external cameras into one group, you can do that and then give it a name for that group, hit done. And then this gives you the ability to have your list of external cameras here. To review playback footage, you can click on the film strip icon. And again, you will have a grid, a blank grid here. If you would like to bring up your camera list, you would just simply click on the controller list there, and you'll have all of your cameras listed on the left. If you click on a camera, it's going to, by default, bring in the uh, video recordings for that day. Or if you wanted to click on a previous day, you just click on it on the calendar and you will have all of your motion events here. You can double click on one of your motion events and then it will play back that clip for you. This has been a brief overview of the Edge Recording Manager Mac version. For further information on our product line, please check us out at www.geovision.com.tw/us. Thanks a lot for watching.